Hello everybody, it's me, your good friend Sparky, and welcome back to Dragon Ball Z Kakarot and our continuing adventures as Bardock, the father of Goku. Or, the father of Kakarot. Because the whole Goku thing, yeah, it's still a little while before that happens. But either way, uh, yeah, we've got things to continue to do here. We've got another mission. We gotta, we gotta go find our buddies. After we had our weird psychic episodes. Um, I don't think there are any side what's it to do at the moment. It doesn't look like it. So we're just going to go ahead right over here. See what's up. See what's going on. We're going to have a good time while doing it. Going to go to the launch pad. Heck yeah. Also going to pick up this thing because I saw it and I want it. Yeah. I got a Z Warrior medal. Cool. That's pretty neat. I suppose. Here we go. Just you wait, guys. I'm on my way. Heck yeah. Let's go to Planet Meat. Heck yeah. All right. Gotta make up for lost time. We're gonna get all the meat. Yum. I presume. I presume it's a planet made entirely of meat. But then again, Planet Vegeta is not a planet made entirely of vegetables. Planet Meat. Just in case you forgot. Go. <laughs> All gone. Not a single one of them is left. All right. <laughs> Guess Planet Meat's all ours now. <laughs> I bet Bardock's gonna be pissed. Right. Seeing his face will be something to look forward to. I'll make it up to the poor bastard. Maybe I'll treat him to a drink when we get back. Give him something to lift his spirits. I better buy him something too. Knowing Bardock, he's probably already on his way here. Sounds about right. Hey, don't talk like that. Who knows what kind of crap he's going to yell at us. Let's get out of here. <laughs> right. Once we get back, we can celebrate his son's... Huh? Huh? Interruptions. What? There. What is that? It's death. It's death. Just just in case you didn't know it's death. <laughs> Those guys sure made a mess of things. There they are. They didn't leave a damn thing for me. They're gonna get a talking to once they're done with their nap in the dirt. What the hell? B Bardock. Hmm? Tora. <coughs> Look at you guys. What the hell happened? <laughs> you lousy dumbass. You should have just stayed home and kept taking your little nap. Forget about that. Did the Mishans do this to you? No. We wiped out all those bastards, no problem. Well then, who the hell did this? It was Frieza. He stabbed every one of us in the back. <coughs> no, you wouldn't. Just as we were about to return to planet Vegeta, the... <clears throat> the cowards attacked us. <coughs> Obviously, we... We didn't go down without a fight. But... <coughs> Vasha... Then Shugesh... Got taken out. Then... They got... Why? Tell me! Why'd you do this? <laughs> you Saiyans really don't know when to die, do ya? D Dorian. 
guess I'll just toy with you a little bit longer. But why? Why are you guys doing this? You really want to know? Fine by me, seeing as you're already as good as dead. <laughs> We're doing this because Lord Frieza ordered us to. What? Lord Frieza said, you Saiyans are starting to be a problem for him. You're lying. We faithfully served Lord Frieza for such a long time. We've done everything he's ordered. And this is what happens if he decides he doesn't like you. So, so this is the thanks we get for all of our hard, <coughs> hard work? <laughs> Basically, it is! <laughs> the, the bastard Frieza. He was just using us the whole time. <coughs> I, I don't have much left of me. Uh, at this rate, Freeze is gonna wipe out all the Saiyans. <coughs> Listen to me, Bardock. You need to go back to planet Vegeta. You gotta rally the troops and take Frieza out. <coughs> Show him what we say and can can really do. <coughs> Looks like now it's your turn to die. Bardock's Spirit of the Warrior Race transformation is now available. For my and let's use it. Boy, they're chatty. Yeah, I didn't really want to interrupt the uh, cutscenes or anything with gags. Ow. Okay, they were kicking the crap out of me. Okay. Probably should have bought healing items now that I think about it. Boy, hard on get stylish. <laughs> um. 
feel bad talking over them. Oh, let go of me. Wow. That's mean. I can't even break out of that. Yeah, I'm gone. I'm dead. They grabbed me, and I just got the crap kicked out of me. Okay, yeah. I feel bad talking over them, because there's a lot of dialogue going on, and, you know, that whole cutscene is a big turning point in the story. Um, we're gonna try again. You... No, you... You need to die. You're the grabby one. You're the very grabby one, and I am not quite fond of that. Oh. Jeez, I guess I just got a mash to get out of that. Otherwise, I just get punched. Jeez. This is not an easy fight. <laughs> Four on one. And they like to pull off some very dirty tricks. Alright. Uh, <laughs> oh, I am totally out of healing items, yeah. I gotta be real careful here, I guess. How about we do a little of this? I definitely turned the volume down on my phone and it decided not to listen to me. Okay. <laughs> that is unfortunate. Gotta be a little more cautious here. Boy, yeah. We just gotta pull out all the stops, be as amazing a Bardock as we can possibly be, and beat up these guys who just murder all of our friends. It's not going well, though, <laughs> because, boy, I am almost dead again. <laughs> I didn't get hit by grabby pants too much this time. Alright, you... A pool look-alike. Uh, how about a little of this? And a little more of this for ya. Whoa, okay. Oh, come on, what was that? I don't even know what he did. All right, try again. All right, yeah, come on. It was not, just, just from the numbers against you, it is, this is not an easy fight, it seems. Well, yeah, man, the, the whole turning point of Bardock learning that Frieza's gonna kill everyone and he just killed all his friends, it, it, it's such a good moment. And especially the fact that Bardock's bandana is not just a red bandana because it matches his uh, little leg and arm warmers there. It's a red bandana because it's soaked with his friend's blood. And it just adds to the amazing badassery that is Bardock. And I think it ends up being, like, another reason why a lot of people really, really, really don't like Dragon Ball Super Bardock. It's because he doesn't have that kind of amazing coolness to him in a lot of cases. Dragon Ball Super Bardock's all right, but man, regular old Bardock, classic Bardock, he really does have some things going for him that the Super Counterpart does not. 
And I lost my transformation. Yeah, laugh it up. Oh, don't punch me. I'm so close. I'm doing really good this time. Boy. You just like to tank hits. Okay, there we go. Get out of here. Alright, let's see what's going on here now. Okay, we're fighting again. I wasn't paying attention. Hi, we're back. Apparently. Don't mind me. I'm just having a uh, vivid hallucination. Yeah, of course it's grabby. Of course it's grabby pants. You, Dodoria subordinate B, you need to learn that no needs no, and you are not allowed to touch me. <laughs> I am giving you the full force of my rage. Because you 100,000% deserve this. Oh, I missed the cool finish with the beam. Now who's stupid, the Saiyan or the guy that gets killed by the Saiyan? Let me ask ya. Don't toy with us! You're going to die just like the other Saiyan trash! Trash. Holy trash here is you! Missed one. <laughs> Dottoria! Why? Why are you doing this? <gasps> it's quite the answer. <laughs> I wanted to play with him a little bit longer. Dodoria, time to head back. Huh? Rendezvous with us right away. We're headed to planet Vegeta. I got it. I wonder why he's going there. Good thing Bardock had his handy corpse shield. Otherwise, he might have died. Ship this one off. Let's see. Destination is toward FX 50. Name Kakarot. Oh, okay. So this is Bardock's kid. Rank is the lowest. He's being shipped to, uh... I wonder where he's going. I guess we'll never know. It's probably not important.
Meanwhile... <laughs> it has been quite some time since I've last seen a good light show. I'm hoping for a splendid display of fireworks. That... that's Lord Frieza's spaceship! No, he's... he's headed toward planet Vegeta, damn it! As if by destiny, father and son pass each other. Hey, you all right? Bardock! What a bummer. If only you'd gotten here sooner. We just sent your kid off. To some remote planet called Earth, I think. Earth? Yeah, a blue planet in some solar system. Though low class, he should be able to wipe the place out in a few months. Planet. Once you're healed up, you can go see him there. But what's going on? Who messed you up this much? You were on planet meat, right? That's it. That planet. Earth. That's gotta be it. The planet I keep seeing. So I was seeing the future. Oh no! Hey, hey, you all right, Bardock? I don't think he's all right. If I'm being perfectly honest, I think he's in pretty bad shape. <sighs> you, you gotta rally the truce and, and take Frieza out. This planet's not going down. should be some people and we need to take a very slow oh, there, buddy. You're in real wounded state. walk down the hallway what the you okay man not really everyone i know and love is dead but you i'm hurt call you, a medic? you look like a ghost your face is a medic shut up well, if it ain't Bardock. Where's your team? Oh no. Probably in a corpse pile somewhere. Easy, man. Where are you going looking like that? Your mom's house. Ugh. Don't push yourself. You gotta get treated and fast. I would say these random sayings are showing a lot of concern for me. It's nice. I'm still hurt. No kidding. Guys, you gotta come with me. We're gonna take down Frieza. What? What are you talking about? You gotta believe me. Tora, my whole team, they were all wiped out. Frieza's gonna do the same to planet Vegeta. To all of us. These guys are not as nice. <laughs> Wipe out the planet, huh? <laughs> you feel it all right? I mean, have you seen him? <laughs> There's no way Lord Frieza would do that. Were you dreaming or something? <laughs> <laughs> Damn all of you! <clears throat> That's it. I'm done. Bastards! All of you, die for all I care! Wait, Bardock! Ah, uh, let him go. The guy's totally lost it. 
I mean, has he? Again, have you seen him? Just now, I hit you with my fabled future punch technique. You should now see that you and your kind are doomed. There is nothing, nothing but annihilation in your future. You will all be wiped out, just like what happened to us. How does it feel knowing the future? Knowing that your days are numbered? <laughs> And between all the flash forwards and flashbacks, Bardock's got a lot going on in his head right now. Do this on my own. I'll be fine. I'll do it. I'll stop him. The future is in my hands. Do or die for the future. The Lone Warrior's final battle. Yeah. Risa, he's already close. Gotta hurry. Kinda at the end of things here. Uh, I did get a few items. I should probably uh add these to my palette while I'm thinking about it. There we go. Don't worry, Bardock. We'll give you a sip of lemonade and you'll be all better. Don't pass out, man. If what I see is really what's going to happen, then that kid must be Kakarot. Probably. Damn it. And that Saiyan Kakarot was fighting. Was that Prince Vegeta? What? It's entirely possible. Why would they fight? Damn! Is that stuff really gonna happen? Oh, huh, well, I guess we'll find out. Or maybe. Maybe we will. Oh, now he's got a spring in his step. I won't let it happen! Bardock Rebellion Rush Super Attack is now available. A new minion has been added to the training grounds. Was that the future too? I have no clue what the hell's going on. And it looks like we've got another side quest to do. But I suppose we'll do that and we'll finish things up with Bardock next time because yeah we're getting pretty close to the end of his tale here until then though and this is your good friend sparky signing off for now and i will catch you later
You know, you think they'd be more inclined to believe the guy who was, like, bleeding out in front of them when he said that Frieza's going to kill them all? Yeah, you would think. <laughs> 